right, Ethan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Way to go, nipple head. <laughs> so there's a proposed cell tower for right, Richter right, Park. That's what I've heard. Yeah. In the park, right. on the golf course. Mm-hmm. Right? That's right. the rec- recommendation. Yep. Now they need a super majority to get this approved. That's mm-hmm. 14 of the 21 city council members right. to say yes. From there, the proposal goes to the Connecticut Siting Council. Uh, can you stop doing that? Which would uh, wow. conduct another public hearing, blah, 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 blah. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah. So we wanted to know what you guys think about this. And I was uh, a little concerned. Like, I, I didn't feel a certain way at first. You know, on the one hand, it's a safety issue. Yeah, you seem hand, very disturbed by that. On the other hand, it's an eyesore. Yes, I don't like when I'm not certain about how I feel. Okay. You know, when, I, when I'm not, things are black and white to me. If I don't have a very strong opinion one way or the other, right, right. it upsets me. But it took me a minute, and I thought about it for a second. I said, hey, it's a golf course. These are golfers. You notice I don't have strong opinions about anything. No, and that bothers me a little bit, too. That bothers me. It bothers me that you don't have strong opinions, and it bothers me that you don't care. It's just easier. That you don't care. It's easier to live. I understand, (laughs) which is why I'm sitting here on a hemorrhoid pillow. (laughs) Right. But I got to the conclusion pretty quickly when I realized it's a golf course, and these are golfers we're talking Mm -hmm. about. And if there's a segment of the community that I could care the least about, it's golfers. Right. I despise them as uh, you know, the majority of them. So you said, yeah. Yeah, I used to be a caddy, and they treated me very poorly. Right. You know, I caddied at a private golf course. Those are the worst people in the world. The private, the private one. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god! I'll do anything I can to inconvenience golfers. When I lived in New Milford not long ago, just uh-huh. moved out of New Milford. That's what I've heard. Yeah. You know, there's a certain way you can go back to my old apartment, mm-hmm. and you go the back way, and you're behind the golf course over here. Yeah. What, what yeah. is it called? The one over here, right Canterwood Valley. Canterwood Valley. Yeah. Yeah. One of the greens is on the back end of a, the the thing there. So uh, if I was lucky enough to be driving on my way home yeah. to see, a, see somebody, you know, putting, mm-hmm. I honk the horn as loud as I can, you yeah, know, yeah. many times. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, at Richter Park, uh, you know, they're crossing the street and their little golf carts. I floor it, baby. Okay. So you know how I feel. <laughs> I say put up seven cell towers. Shit, can we go to the phone now? All right. A 95, hello. Hey, are you guys talking about the cell towers? Cell yeah. tower, Richter Park. I- I'm just saying, it's 2016 and we, we, we lose calls everywhere. Right. You know, I'm for the cell tower, and golf is lame. Thank you. Thank you. I'm just, I'm just saying, you want a game of skill? Play miniature golf. You know, that goddamn <laughs> windmill, I can't get past it. You, you hit it every time, you, don't you? You nailed it. You nailed it. Just say it, man. Thank Hate you, guys. That damn I, thing. I said they put a roller coaster out there. Yeah? Yeah. I-95. Yeah. Hey, how's it going? Good. Good. How are you doing? Good. What are your thoughts uh, on the cell tower? Uh, yeah, I just wanted to share. I, I mean, I'm, I agree with the opinion that I really hate golfers. I, I, I'm a golfer myself, and I hate them because they're all better than I am. <laughs> yeah, well, that's um, understandable. Yeah, but, but, yeah. Let's put the cell tower up. I, I mean, I, I think it's, it's good for the community for everybody. Well, it's, around. A tw- it's a 21st century. We need cell service. We need cell service. Yeah, exactly. You know, we didn't have telephone poles or uh, street lights or uh, anything like that a hundred years ago, and people complained about those being a uh, kind of an eyesore. Right. So I, I think it's it's needed for progression, and, and plus I want to give these these, uh, these amateur scratch golfers uh, something to complain about. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I hear you, buddy. I'm with you. Thank you. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Bye bye. I ninety five. Ethan and Lou. Hey, I gotta agree with Lou on one thing. What's that? Some of these golfers are just rich freaking snobs. I'll tell you a story. Me and my buddy back when we were uh, teenagers, we chatted for these two guys. Hot as hell out. We're out there for like three to four hours, sweating our nuts off. These guys said, I don't worry, we'll pay you real good. They pay the cheeks 75 freaking cents. No. 75 oh cents? Oh, my God. 75 cents for three hours of sweating our nuts off. Oh, my God. I would God. have kicked them in the nuts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, we need more snow towers, man. It is a safety issue. You know, I'm on the road a lot. You know, I'm driving a propane truck, and I'm in areas where, you know, anything could happen. Sometimes somebody's life might depend on, you know, having a cell phone that, that can work. You're right, bro. Thank you. Even up at uh, Richfield High School, there's no cell service. That's not good. No. That's uh, not good. Have a good one, guys. Thanks you for the too. call. Sometimes I watch Caddyshack, I get mad. Do you? Yeah, because it's it's that comical. It's really that comical yeah. when, you, when you're a caddy. It's like super annoying. Hello, I-95. Yeah, just think about the cell phone tower. We've got wires all over the place, and they're complaining about a single pole with a bunch of things hanging off of it. Yet we got wires hanging from everywhere throughout the city. That's true. Thank true you. that. We need it. Thanks Appreciate for- it, man. Thanks for the great show you guys put out. Thank, Thank you, you, man. Appreciate it. I-95, Ethan and Lou. Hello. What's up, guys? What's hey, going on? What's up? Uh, I just want to know from the official, why all of a sudden there's a safety issue all these years? I've been houses burning down all over the place since now this proposed tower is supposed to go up. I don't get it. Yeah. <laughs> no, you're right. <laughs> I mean, technology's moving too quick, man. People are too busy with cell towers and everything else. What did they do before? Did they just 
saw the house burn down, and that was it. Well, it, we've become reliant on it, so now people need it. Exactly what's happening. That's the problem. And it's a scary thing. The whole system goes down. We're all screwed. Nobody yeah. knows how to pick their own friggin' nose. That's correct. <laughs> Thanks, man. Good to day, guys. Ah, you too. Bye -bye. Hey, I-95, uh, what's going on? Yeah, good morning, fellas. Hey, I'm for the cell tower because number 11 has a pond in front of the green, <laughs> so if you put your ball in the water, you can blame it on the cell tower. <laughs> I like your thinking, that's, brother. That's a, okay. Fresh way. Is, is it a dog leg left or right? Uh, it's just straight down the hill, and there's straight. a small pond in front of the green, so if it, the, the cell tower could be a distraction to a golfer. All right, there you go. Thanks, man. Okay, bye. I used to put it in the pond every single time I played. <laughs> I'm going to get that put on a T-shirt. Nobody knows how to pick their own friggin' nose. I'm going to wear it every day. I kind of like that. That's original it's you know, stuff. It's, it's original stuff. Yeah, we're good stuff. Right. We're all about beefing it up, raging in unison, and okay. seeing the future of your life on the Ethan and uh, Lou Miracle so, Network. Dude, what are you queuing me for? I'm queuing you to go to the break. I'm not ready to go to the break. Well, it's time. <laughs> because I'm out of things to say. <laughs> okay. It's 8.57 here. 83 is sunny today. The Tri-State area.